Hello, hi, welcome. This is STV Sports Channel. You are watching a great match today. It's uh, the match uh, ICC T20 World Cup match number nine between Bangladesh and Papua New Guinea. 182. Earlier, uh, uh, Bangladesh who won the toss and elected to bat, and uh, they have fixed 182 as a target. 181 for the loss of seven in 20 overs. They have finished. And it's uh, 182 is a target for uh, Papua New Guinea. Will uh, in the meantime, uh, it's uh, Papua New Guinea who have started their batting. It's uh, not a good batting at all. Already they lost four wickets. Not a good thing at all. A good bad start they have done, and it's not a good start for them. And even it's a very very tough match for Papua New Guinea. As of now, Bangladesh will definitely qualify for the. Um, for the playing 12 of uh, the Super 12, Super 12 uh, in the uh, T20 World Cup. So here it is the opportunity for the <coughs> for the Bangladesh. And as we can see, highest score so far 182 in ODI. That is uh, very very important. Uh, Hari and uh, 
Uh, even though the Papua New Guinea uh, Shagib Al Hassan uh, two wickets of uh, six runs so far, a fantastic spell in his two overs. He is bowling his third over now. Will it be a big opportunity here at uh, Papua New Guinea? Uh, they are bowling. Uh, their batting is uh, not uh, above average. It's only average. We cannot say. <coughs> Shaki Ballas and uh, the man who is uh, continuing his uh, bowling attack, uh, he has uh, uh, picked two wickets in his uh, seven runs uh, he has given in his uh, three overs. Third over he is bowling now. Can we get uh, somewhat uh, a good opportunity here at this moment? It's not good sign for PNG. <coughs> shot, fantastic shot. Will that be? Yes, it's a catch. One more wicket gone. So it's not good sign. Already Saiba Lassan gets another wicket here. Sisa Bao got out for 7 runs of 22 balls. Not a good thing on the board. 24 for the loss of 8.5 5 overs. So definitely the possibility for the uh, Bangladesh are very bright today and as we can see what are all the opportunities available here at this moment it's a good sign we can say that uh, As you can see on the table that uh, the in group A, it's uh, Sri Lanka who already qualified for the four uh, with four points. They definitely will qualify along with Ireland. So whether it is Ireland or Namibia, that is a question. But in the meantime, it's uh, Scotland and as well uh, for the women. These two are already at the top two place. Bangladesh, if they win today, definitely they will be qualified uh, in a, uh, uh, for the. Uh, second and uh, Scotland and Bangladesh will qualify for the final. So definitely in Group B we can expect uh, Scotland along with Bangladesh. Both them, both of them will qualify as well in the in the in the Group A with Sri Lanka. If uh, Namibia wins today, definitely they will be qualified. Otherwise, it will be from Ireland to make it happen. So these are all the opportunities here to qualify and go for the Super 12. <coughs> One more wicket gone again here. So consecutive wickets are going for Papua New Guinea. Definitely we cannot expect much from the rest of the batters. So it's already gone. Uh, so the new man gone out, uh, Norman Vanua is also got out. So not getting much runs on the board. It's the end of the 9.2 overs, uh, 24 for the loss of six for Papua New Guinea. Not a good sign for them even. It's drinks break now. Mushfikar Rahim completes uh, the catch uh, from the uh, Mahidi. Mahidi who strikes it well. And yet another wicket gone as of now. It's uh, six wickets for uh, Papua New Guinea. 24 for six. Not good runs on the board. It's already 182 required. So 158 required now to win in. 64 balls not a good thing at all so it's a bad opportunity here to for the bad um, start for the png even 
We'll have to wait and see what will be the rest. Stay tuned, we'll be coming back after a small break.
Welcome back to STV Sports Channel. It's uh, Bangladesh are in a very good form today. They are winning the second match against uh, Papua New Guinea. Will that be a great another victory here for Bangladesh? Can we have uh, if uh, Bangladesh wins today? Can we have uh, that? Uh, will be at. Uh, Will out be a run out? Yes, it is a run out now. It's a run out chances are there. Yes, it is a run out and ninth wicket count. 79 for the loss of nine now. Not a good decision. Not of course not a good decision to go for the second. It's not good one. Yes, it is clean out. And Bangladesh roaring back to get those uh, fantastic win here against uh, Papua New Guinea. It's out is confirmed and it's uh, 80 for the loss of uh, nine run, nine wickets. The last man to go into the middle now, Papua Moria, with two runs uh, in his uh, three runs in his account, got out, run out, a uh, peep with the man who make it, made it already. So 80 for the loss of nine and it's. Uh, Last one more wicket to go. Last one more. 101 run. Of course, 101 runs to win this uh, uh, in 13 balls. 13 balls, only 101 runs. Of course, uh, only 13 balls, 101 runs. It's not at all possible. Definitely, it will be a great win for Bangladesh. 
with the rate or run rate uh, concern if they get a maximum run rate definitely that will be the final for the rest of the uh, teams and it's a very great last man in is uh, Ravu the man into the freeze now you can see these are all the batting structure as what uh, Papua New Guinea not uh, making it right today biggest ever win in T20 internationals by Bangladesh biggest win today but uh, with a very good uh, bowling attack of uh, Bangladesh bowlers and they have done it very well and it's a fantastic batting from their batting batters also all put together they have done a marvelous and fantastic win over the team already it's a great uh, as we can see that uh, all those uh, Papua New Guinea are all got out for in single digits it's not two digits even Dogira the only man Doriga and uh, Naim got stuck out and uh, Litanda 29 uh, Shaikyo Shakilo Shakib 46 and Musa Begir 5 and Muhammadullah 50 captain Hafif Hussain 21 and Shai Fudin 19, Mahadi Asan 2, Extras 9, total 181 is a total for Bangladesh in return to their Papua New Guinea. Loga Slaka is on 5, got out. Asad Wala 6, Charles uh, got 1, Sibau 7, Shimon Atal he got, and it's a 6 here. Very fantastic maximum here. Hari Hari got 8 and Norman Wawa 0 and uh, Kiplin Doriga. Kiplin Doriga wicket keeper got 43 and uh, it's uh, Charles Super Soper 11 and Kabu Amuria 3 and uh, Domain Rao the new man into the crease with single. So they can expect a, a beautiful uh, run, a six runs of it. Musafi Rakma, another one, it's a single. Will that be a single as yes, it is? Musafi Rakma and uh, Bangladesh with uh, Papua New Guinea. It's a fantastic match is going on at the middle, but it's not. Uh, good runs on the board but it's 90 for the loss of nine another uh, few more balls to go it's 18.2 overs gone 1.4 overs to go 10 balls we can say and uh, another 92 runs required will that be restricted to some of uh, good things wow what a shot it is from the straight down to the ground great shot from the uh, Ravu even Mustafa here is being uh, punished it off 94 for the loss of time. That was uh, the bowler and fantastic boundary here. So we can expect uh, some under runs, uh, more than under runs uh, from these two guys. So of course, uh, of course, uh, the total will be 100. 94 now. Another six can be added definitely possible and there are uh, uh, at, the, in, at the end of uh, this uh, match it's a huge uh, we can see a huge run on the card 95 for the loss of 9 now another 5 to reach the 100 runs 87 runs required to win in seven balls that is uh, the criteria now without wait and see what will be the next 
white ball one more white into the place now so 96 for the loss of uh, 9 now Coplin Doriga in a 44 of 32 he has been the only batsman of uh, PNG who got uh, 44 runs uh, in his account he's the only double scorer rest of all them are single digit scorer that's the end of uh, the over number 19 one more over to go definitely we can expect 100 plus runs here so with that uh, the run rate will not be too much high if uh, Oman get uh, four uh, two points in winning the next match definitely that will be a question in uh, as well as we can see on the scorecards of uh, that is points table we can take it as uh, concern and you can see the points table on the on the other hand yes you can see that scotland will take on oman now bangladesh if they get four points definitely they will get uh, one plus one uh, and lead the toy table if it is a uh, scotland if oman gets uh, some good run rate definitely that will be the end of the scotland it's not for the uh, Bangladesh it's uh, definitely for the Scotland to go out so that has to be done by women it's not that much easy we'll have to wait and see what will be the rest and things are going in favor of uh, the Bangladesh today not a bad thing at all they have done a very good uh, uh, exposure today with a bat and the ball now with a bat early and ball now 181 runs is not an ordinary runs on the board it is a very fantastic maximum runs this is the highest run total for the bangladesh uh, for the bangladesh uh, uh, in the uh, world cup t20 this is the highest uh, total for them 181 and a good win even we'll have to wait and see so two balls have been bowled so far dot falls and two dot falls 97 for the loss of nine now and the picket caught out 10 and it's end of uh, the Papua New Guinea it's uh, Bangladesh won by 84 runs that is uh, the criteria here at this moment so they have uh, plenty of uh, opportunities here at this moment and Bangladesh are through to the final now through to the playing super 12 definitely that will be the end of uh, the innings of papua new guinea and it's bangladesh uh, who are very well celebrating and they are qualified in the super 12s definitely bangladesh are qualified for the super 12 whether it is scotland wins or Oman wins what will be the scenario is definitely bangladesh will not uh, uh, having any will not be having any problem it's uh, scotland if woman wins scotland will have the problem if uh, um, scotland wins definitely woman will have the problem definitely it's bangladesh who are on top can win over of course uh, he, he is qualified in the uh, playing super 12 so those who are watching our channel are hereby requested to subscribe don't forget to press the notification and don't forget to recommend the same to your friends and family it's good to have you all in the very good match here at this moment thank you for watching stv sport channel we will have a lot more in the rest of the uh, matches in the rest of the time don't go away we will have another match today stay tuned to stv sport channel we'll be coming back in another short while from now have a great day. Enjoy the moment. Enjoy the cricket. Enjoy the game. Enjoy STV Sports Channel. Thank you, each and every one of you. Have a great day. Bye. It's bye from STV Sports Group.
Thank you.